Have you ever thought to yourself, I only have peanut butter and egg and some sugar, and I would love some peanut butter cookies. Well, now you can. That's the intro I'm going with. I'm not, I'm not doing that again. So if you'd like to join me, please do. Let's make some cookies. Okay, you're coming with me. I've got great angles and camera and lighting and all that, so. I have the no need to stir. I think this is a large. Have some sugar, some regular granulated sugar. I'm gonna get my apron on. I haven't made videos in a while, I know this. Let's just jump into having some fun making some cookies. It's so much fun to make these. Really nothing to it. Got a mixing bowl. I'm not, I'm not currently, I'm not currently grabbing a mixing bowl that I should have already had prepared. That's my breakfast, don't judge. So I usually will crack the egg first because if there's something wrong with the egg, you don't want to put that into everything else after. Crack that egg. I don't know if you want to see that up close, it's an egg in a bowl. That's all it is. Always wash your hands. So I realized the whole cup was in the dishwasher, so I can't use it. So I'm gonna be using a half a cup twice, cause half whole. The peanut butter is gonna be more of a pain in the butt, just because it's peanut butter. Now you could whisk if you want. You could even use a mixer if you want. Mixer is a better idea than using a whisk in my opinion. A whisk it gets a little sticky. I'm just gonna use a fork. So this is what it looks like. I'm just gonna... Okay, time to make this into cookies. Take a tablespoon, because you could take a, a teaspoon if you'd like to make smaller cookies. Just gonna take a scoop like this. Um, to me, it's not a big deal if they're round. Uh, I just want some cookies. If you want them to be rounder, you can shape them a little bit. Like I said, I'm not too worried about it because the next step is the thing with the fork. If you know peanut butter cookies, you know, oh yeah, they have a fork pattern on top. So I'm just going to press down pretty hard and roll it off. Okay, and now we do them perpendicular. Like I said, unless you're going for perfection, it's not that serious. Let me put the timer on before I forget. I'll see you in 10 minutes. Maybe I'll have some of that sandwich. Hmm. All that steam. So this is how big they get. Don't try to pull them off now. Trust me, they will fall apart. It's very bendy. It'll break. It's been a little while, maybe like 10 minutes. They're still pretty warm, but they're, it's now, feel carefully, it's still warm. Nice and browned on the bottom. A little oily, peanut butter. And because watching people eat is a thing. Sugary peanut butter cookie. A little soft, grainy in that like sandy cookie type of way. Pretty good for a very simple peanut butter cookie. I don't know what else to say. There was a cookie here. It's gone now. So that was peanut butter cookies. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>